Well, hello, friends and neighbors, brothers and sisters in Christ, and those seeking the truth. It is um, getting to be the end of December 2020, and I'm going to uh, read day four for the 30-day Billy Graham Association Prayer Guide for America. And uh, this one is pretty, um, pretty set, pretty, um, pretty good timing for uh, our struggles of our recent election. Not so recent election at this point, but it's still being ironed out. And um, the truth will be coming out. And uh, actually, the truth is out, but a lot of the main venues to people's houses, i.e. mainstream media, are are, are fighting the truth and trying to pretend that their um, Marxist buddies actually pull off a major coup and illegally rigged our elections. And, and so this is a, actually a, a, an interesting one. Um, and that's why I've got my Make America Great Again hat on for this. <laughs> and... Um, Hold the line, patriots. It's far from over, and the best is yet to come. God wins, and the little liar enemy already lost. That's the greatness of it. So, day four. I'll go through the, the prayer ideas. I'll read the Bible quote associated with it then go over the prayer again, and then we can pray silently together. All right? And uh, I think this is working out pretty good. So day four of the 30-day prayer guide for America. Pray that men and women of God will be elected to public office in all levels of leadership, local, state, and national. And Psalm 33, 12 says, Blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord. The people whom he has chosen as his heritage. Let me read that again. Blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord. The people whom he has chosen as his heritage heritage. Make sure your God is the Lord, the Lord of Abraham, Moses, Jesus, Jesus' dad, your heavenly Papa. Make sure that's your God and not mammon and the false idols that sing and dance and do strange things <laughs> on your screens, those are not gods. Those are, those are not to be worshipped. But let us pray that men and women of God will be elected to public office. And that's in all the levels of leadership, local, state, and national. So... Go ahead and pray for them. Jeez. Yes, God. Hallelujah. Amen. Go ahead and pause this if you need to pray a little longer. Don't. Don't ever stop praying when you're in, when you're in that place. And um, you know, if you go over to the the Billy Graham Evangelical Association's website, I think you can find this guide there. I printed this up from there, um, so you could read along with me, or you could um, you know just go. You could do this. Day, day by day as well. So thank you for joining me 
and we'll have day number five in the 30-day prayer guide coming at you soon. Many blessings of abundance, of great health, of love, of patience, of kindness, of boldness, of wisdom to you and your families and have a great day. Thanks for joining me and um, I'll talk to you soon. Bye.